Install the lower oil deflector. Install the bearing after installing the bearing ring on the lower bearing number 8. Push and install the packing segment rings into the home. Install each diaphragm carefully. After assembling the diaphragm packing segment rings of the LPB lower diaphragm into the home, Tighten bolts of LPB lower diaphragm. Push and install the packing segment rings into the home. Install the lower oil deflector. Install the bearing after installing the bearing ring of the lower bearing number 7. Install the lower oil deflector. Install the bearing after installing the bearing ring of the lower bearing number 6. Push and install the packing segment rings into the home. Install each diaphragm carefully after assembling the diaphragm packing segment rings of the LPA lower diaphragm into the home. Tighten bolts with the LPA lower diaphragm. Push and install the packing segment rings into home. Install the lower oil deflector. Install the bearing after installing the bearing ring of the lower bearing number 5. Install the lower bearing after installing the tilting pads at lower bearing number 4 into the home and assembling locking pins and bolts. Push and install the packing segment rings into home. Install the lower gland packing head number 4. Install each diaphragm carefully after assembling the diaphragm packing segment rings of the IP lower diaphragm into the home.
tighten bolts with the IP lower diaphragm. Push and install the packing segment rings into home. Install the lower gland packing head number 3. Install the lower bearing after installing the tilting pads of the lower bearing number 3 by pushing it to the home and assembling locking pins and bolts. Install the lower thrust bearing. Assemble the lower bearing after installing the tilting pads of the lower bearing number 2 by pushing it to the home and assembling locking pins and bolts. Push and install the packing segment rings into home. Install the lower nozzle box. Install each diaphragm carefully after assembling the diaphragm packing segment rings of the HP lower diaphragm into the home. Tighten bolts with the HP lower diaphragm. Push and install the packing segment rings into home. Install the lower gland packing head number 1. Install the lower bearing after installing the tilting pads at lower bearing number 1 into the home and assembling locking pins and bolts. Install the HP rotor carefully using the lifting beam so that it won't touch bucket and diaphragm. Install the IP rotor carefully using the lifting beam so that it won't touch bucket and diaphragm. Install the LPA rotor carefully using the lifting beam so that it won't touch bucket and diaphragm. Install the LPB rotor carefully using the lifting beam so that it won't touch bucket and diaphragm. Tighten coupling bolts after assembling coupling in rotor.
Tighten bolts after installing the thrust bearing. Assemble the thermocouple. Tighten bolts after installing the turning gear. Assemble the differential expansion detector. Assemble the upper LPB in the same procedure, like the upper LPA. Install the diaphragm after assembling the diaphragm packing segment rings of the LPA upper diaphragm into the home. Tighten diaphragm bolts. Install the LPA inner casing takedown carefully using the crane. Assemble LPA inner casing outer bolts. Assemble LPA inner casing inner bolts. Connect spray water pipes. Assemble the manholes of the LPA inner casing. Push and install the packing segment rings into home. Tighten bolts after installing gland packing head number 6. Push and install the packing segment rings into home. Tighten bolts after installing gland packing head number 5. Install the LPA hood, which the level has been adjusted, after moving it to the installation location, and be careful of the vertical flanges space of the gland packing casing. Tighten LPA casing bolt. Assemble the rupture disc after assembling the keys. Assemble the manhole of the LPA casing.
Tighten gland packing casing bolt. Tighten bolts after installing the upper bearing. Tighten bolts with taper threads plug after installing the upper bearing ring. Assemble the vibration detector. Install the upper coupling guard after installing down the lower coupling guard carefully. Tighten bolts with the coupling guard. Install the upper bearing standard. Tighten bearing standard bolts. Tighten gland packing casing bolt. Tighten bolts after installing the upper bearing. Tighten bolts with taper threads plug after installing the upper bearing ring. Assemble the vibration detector. Install the diaphragm after assembling the diaphragm packing segment rings of the IP upper diaphragm into the home. Tighten diaphragm bolts. Push and install the packing segment rings into home. Tighten bolts after installing gland packing head number 4. Push and install the packing segment rings into home. Tighten bolts after installing gland packing head number 3. Install the upper IP inner casing down carefully using the crane after adjusting the level. Tighten IP inner casing high temperature bolts. Install the upper IP outer casing down carefully using the crane after adjusting the level. Tighten bolts with packing casing. Assemble the upper casing key. Tighten IP outer casing high temperature bolts. Change arm keys.
tighten hold down bolts. Install the upper coupling guard after installing down the lower coupling guard carefully. Tighten bolts with the coupling guard. Tighten bolts after installing the oil deflector. Assemble locking pins and taper threads plug after assembling the tilting pads by pushing it to the home. Tighten bolts after installing the upper bearing. Assemble the vibration detector. Install the upper bearing standard. Tighten bolts with the bearing standard. Assemble the key. Install the upper coupling guard after installing down the lower coupling guard carefully. Tighten bolts with the coupling guard. Tighten bolts after installing the oil deflector. Assemble locking pins and taper threads plug after assembling the tilting pads by pushing it to the home. Tighten bolts after installing the upper bearing. Assemble the vibration detector. Assemble locking pins and taper threads plug after assembling the tilting pads by pushing it to the home. Tighten bolts after installing the upper bearing. Assemble the vibration detector. Install the upper bearing standard. Tighten bolts with the bearing standard. Assemble the key. Assemble the diaphragm after assembling the diaphragm packing segment rings at HP upper diaphragm by pushing it to the home.
tighten diaphragm bolts. Push and install the packing segment rings into home. Tighten bolts after installing the gland packing head. Tighten bolts after installing the upper nozzle box. Install the upper HP inner casing down carefully, using the crane after adjusting the level. Tighten HP inner casing high temperature bolts. Install the upper HP inner casing down carefully using the crane after adjusting the level. Tighten packing casing bolts. Assemble the thermocouples and the jib key of the upper casing. Tighten HP outer casing high temperature bolts. Change arm keys. Tighten hold down bolts. Tighten bolts after installing the lower oil deflector. Assemble locking pins and taper threads plug after assembling the tilting pads by pushing it to the home. Tighten bolts after installing the upper bearing. Assemble the vibration detector. Assemble the detector. Tighten bolts after installing the front standard upper casing. Tighten bolts and oil deflector. Connect pipes to the casing. Tighten nuts with bolts. Install the crossover pipe C after installation the crane. Tighten horizontal and vertical flange bolts. Install the crossover pipe B after installation the crane. Tighten horizontal and vertical flange bolts.
Install the crossover pipe bay after installation the crane. Tighten horizontal and vertical flange bolts. Install the lagging.